Uh oh. Hey, what's up guys? Kevin here. So tomorrow I'm traveling to Mammoth Mountain, California. It's my first time ever going to Mammoth. I'm meeting up with TJ and the Sport RX crew. We're gonna do a week of riding and filming, but today I've actually got to pack my bags because I've got 10 and a half hours of traveling to do tomorrow and I've got to pack tonight. So I got to decide which snowboard I'm gonna bring, which pairs of goggles, and see if I can fit everything into my snowboard travel bag. So I'll take you guys through all the stuff I'm gonna bring on the trip from camera gear, snowboard accessories, everything like that, and get it packed into my snowboard bag. Let's do it. So I'm gonna be bringing this snowboard bag with me tomorrow. So it's my Burton snowboard bag. It's pretty big, lots of room in there. I was gonna bring this brand new Dekine bag, but I feel like it's a little bit smaller and I've got quite a lot of stuff to bring. So of all my snowboards, I gotta bring the T-Rice Pro. It's my brand new board. It's built for carving for all mountain, can take it into powder, very versatile board. And I'm also gonna take the Arbor Westmark Rocker. It's just a fun, buttery, jibby board that I haven't had much experience with yet, and it should be a good time testing both of these boards out. So this is pretty tough, bringing my goggles. I'm just gonna go for my five favorite pairs, the ones that fit me the best, and also that I have two lenses for because I don't know what the weather's gonna be like each day. Whew, this is tough. Okay, five favorite pairs. So gonna bring the Oakley Line Miners for sure, the Squad XLs, the Dragons. Gotta bring the Flight Decks, the Electric EG3s. So I've got my goggles all packed up here, but I'm not gonna pack them until the end because I don't want them getting crushed under something heavy. All right, so the next thing I'm gonna go for, definitely get the snowboard boots in here. They're very heavy. Typically put my snowboard boots at either end. Also probably find some like accessories and things to put inside my boots to keep safe. Uh, we'll see what I can get inside of there later. I'm kind of debating on whether or not I should bring my boot dryer. I may bring it though, because there's nothing worse than having wet boots. So I'll see if I can fit this in at the end. I've got three pairs of snowboard socks to bring on the trip. I'm gonna also bring my regular socks. Hopefully there's a washer dryer to clean my socks halfway through. I think these probably will stuff nicely into my snowboard boots. For mitts, I'm actually gonna bring both pairs. The Neff Ripper, these are pretty light, and then also my Dekine, which are much heavier, better for those warmer days. Can't forget my helmet, this is definitely a priority. I'm also gonna bring my impact shorts. I haven't had to actually use these yet, but I'm super happy I picked them up. Just giving me a bit extra confidence. If you're a new snowboarder, I definitely recommend checking out some impact shorts. Can just uh, protect your tailbone and your hips from any sort of falls or anything like that. Definitely check these guys out. Also got my Dekine bib pants here to bring. As you guys know, I've been absolutely loving these bibs. Just uh, feel really free and open riding with these on. I've got the No Bad Day jacket here, but it's actually too small for me, even though it's an extra large. So keep an eye out, there'll probably be a giveaway sometime in the future. But I am gonna wear my Dekine Vapor jacket there. Bella Clavis as well, I've got my lightweight, my midweight. I've also just picked up this analog, you know, heavier balaclava, so I've got three. One for any kind of conditions that run into down at Mammoth. Gonna attempt to pack my goggles in the safest spots. For my base layers, I'm actually bringing two base layers. I've got my Air Blaster Ninja Suit and I've got a mid-level Dekine base layer. Both, just because I won't be able to do laundry every day, so two is better than one. I'm also bringing my massage ball. This is perfect after snowboarding. Any tight muscles, anything like that, can roll them out with this massage ball. Toss this in here, definitely will save me. For my camera gear on this trip, I'm gonna be traveling pretty light. So as you guys know, I got the Karma Grip. So I'll be using this quite a bit, testing out the Karma Grip with TJ. Right now, I'm filming with the GoPro 6. 
Definitely liking the stabilization on it compared to the 5. I find it much better for stabilization, so that's perfect for snowboarding. Gonna bring a backup just portable charger. This is good for my phone. Plug in my phone or plug in the camera or the grip. And then also, I've got four batteries for the GoPro 6. So two in here with the charger. And that way, if I'm up the mountain, there's, there's no way I'm gonna go through four batteries. I also use my iPhone 6 as a backup camera. So between the GoPro, my phone, extra batteries, and the Karma Grip, I should be good for filming. I've decided that I actually am gonna bring my boot dryer. It comes apart into a bunch of different pieces. I think this will be fine going through the airline. Also a heavy duty screwdriver just for getting my bindings on and off. I'm also gonna bring my backpack on the trip. I'll get my computer in here for the traveling. Then once I get down to Mammoth, I can take my computer gear out and then use this on the mountain just for carrying around any like snacks or spare things, camera gear, stuff like that. I'm also gonna bring a small carry-on just full of all my like extra clothes, toiletries, things like that. And then snowboard bag, I think I've got everything. So I actually forgot that Sporter X sent me out all these hard cases for the goggles. So I can just put the goggles in there and now they'll be protected. And there's no risk of having them damaged along the way. Uh-oh. All right guys, so I've got everything packed up. It's a tough call on the boards, but got, brought two boards. Few pairs of goggles, got all my accessories, my pants, helmet, gloves, all kinds of stuff like that. If you guys are gonna do any traveling, definitely recommend checking out a bag with wheels. It's just so much easier getting your stuff to the airport on and off of buses with a snowboard bag with wheels, definitely save you. Still have my smaller bag to pack just with some clothes and toiletries and things like that. But other than that, ready to go. Excited about the travel day tomorrow. Gonna make a vlog on that for you guys. And excited to see TJ and the Sporter X guys for a week of snowboarding and filming in Mammoth. If you guys have any tips that I missed about packing for a snowboard trip, it'd be great to hear about them down in the comments. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.